Hey DC, are you ready to party? Well, you tune into the right place. Parties are back on. Claire Huxtable is in DC, Fine Arts. And Black Lives Matter Plaza Mural, where is it at? Ladies and gentlemen, it's time for What's Going On DC. First up, starting June 6, Metro will expand late night service to 36 of the busiest bus routes in the DMV. So you know what that means. It's Lady Bus time. It's Lady Bus time. Y'all get the joke if you watch the show. Mayor Bowser just lifted capacity restrictions after June 11th. And fresh off that announcement, our good old Rose Bar just announced it's party time, opening June 11th to be exact. Hey, who remembers the DC sniper? I know I damn sure do. Well, the story of him and his own words are coming to vice. Boo, who cares? Why do we keep giving murderous platforms? In sports, Russell Westbrook makes history as officially the NBA's all-time triple-double leader. I'm loving this winning season for the Wizards. Also in sports, the NFL announces giving $2.5 million in grants to two nonprofits, particularly here in DC. A DC-based United Negro College Fund and the Council on Legal Education Opportunity, Inc. You can read more about that at thewashingtoninformer.com. And we stay in open news, it's official. Crystal Skating Ring, well, Temple Hill Skating Ring, is open for another year. Landlords worked out a new lease, so go ahead and get your skate on, folks. Where is Black Lives Matter mural, you say? Unfortunately, the painting at 1600 Black Lives Matter Plaza is currently gone due to work to be done underground. Let's hope it's coming back as Mayor Bowser is fighting for the exhibition to be permanent. Hello, MPD. This is not Fast and the Furious. Two DC officers who were drag racing and crashed are now facing multiple charges, including reckless driving. Ouch. Speaking of MPD, Robert Conti was just confirmed as the new chief of MPD. They are also getting hacked if they don't cough up $4 million. Read this right now. Hey DC, let's welcome back the beautiful Claire Huxtable to DC, that's right. Actress and humanitarian Felicia Rashad is now Howard University's new Dean of the College of Fine Arts. That's what I'm talking about. Can we still re-register for college and not pay no tuition? Cause I love to be in, in those classes. <laughs> Congratulations to DMV's own Project Santana, who was just announced a contestant on The Cosign, a show on the Genius platform. Round of applause for this guy. I told you the DMV music scene is winning. Now as we leave, I want you to check out the newly remixed Bust it. So, Juki's music, you know, the one who made the Junebug challenge go viral for DC. Well, he's doing the same thing for Bust it, and I want you to check it out. But before then, make sure you're all caught up by heading over to wibridgedc.com and make sure to follow the hashtags WGODC and WIBridge TMP style for all the looks. I want you to enjoy your weekend. I'm your boy, the Media Prince. Now let's go. Bless it. <laughs>